Hi guys, I'm on my way to the Chanel private sale today. I will take you with me and show you if I end up trying anything. The sale will include pieces from 2022 collections, B, K, A and N, I think, collections. So 22K, 22N, B. And yeah, let's see if I can find anything. Stay tuned for the unboxing at the end, see if there is any. If I end up picking anything up, I will show you. So yeah, let's go and see, I'm excited. Okay guys, so here are some of the pieces I want to try on from the ready to wear these shorts. I think they're a bit small unfortunately, but look how nice they are. And then we have this skirt, this waistcoat, it's knitted and it has pearls. And also this tweed jacket is amazing, but it's a really big size. I know this will be too big, but it is a stunning tweed. This is the price. Then I also wanted to show you these shoes. They are so beautiful, but a bit too high for me, unfortunately. And these boots I absolutely love. But do I really need another pair of black boots? I'm not sure. Still deciding if I should go for them. Also found some jewelry. Another pair of shoes that I wanted to show you. Look at these sandals with pearls in black. Very classic, very typical Chanel. This is the price. Okay, let's quickly have a look at the shoes. So all these are on sale. They have many of these sandals in velvet. Quite a few boots. And you guys, these are amazing, but they're not my size. Here are some more that I actually quite like. Okay, I wanted to give these a go. They're actually very comfortable. Surprisingly, I don't find these as comfortable as the pink ones. Another great find. Look at these and the price. I love them. I actually do really like these and they have little sequins. Can you see how they sparkle? This is the price, 40% of 732 pounds. Stop Harrods to check the sale there. Okay, guys, I actually found quite a few accessories like this cute tweed hat. It actually had quite a few hats, bucket hats. 
also i can't believe i found these amazing bracelets also some of these the necklace and the heart accessory i actually really like this disco ball necklace okay these are the only ready to wear pieces i really like look at the sleeves first of all and the buttons it has amazing tweed but it is size 38 i'm not sure if i'll be able to button it up also i found these leggings this is the velvet i'm not sure how i feel about these but i was curious the skirt and also I found these tweed shorts I showed you earlier, but these are my size. Oh, I love these sleeves, but unfortunately, guys, look, I need a size up. These are definitely, I now I actually hate them. <laughs> update about the chanel sale i picked up some small stuff <laughs> but the ready to wear selection was very poor they did have some cushions which surprised me but they were very colorful they had quite a lot of accessories gloves um but yeah they're ready to wear quite disappointing compared to last year's and the years before but they do have a public shoe sale so we're gonna go check out the shoes now but they're open to the public so anyone can go Oh, look at these logo boots. I can check again, but how much is it? I'm obsessed with these, but guess what? They don't have my size. Look, they have these furry ones in white. Okay, I have to try them on. Again, they don't have my size. I'm dying. I'm so sad. Found another pair of boots that I quite like. That's the price, and I love the classic beige. Mm. You guys, I really like this style, and I love the quilted pattern. Mm. These are in shilling, and they're lined inside as well. You guys, check these out. Look at the price. Look how cool they look. Hi guys, I'm back from the sales and oh wow, it was so disappointing. The selection, the ready to wear selection, I couldn't find anything, spoiler alert, this 
this is all I got in this small bag. I picked up two pieces only. At least I found some stuff that I really, really love. I found some gems in here, so I can't wait to show you. But I really was hoping to find some ready-to-wear pieces. I love buying ready-to-wear 40% off. It's definitely worth it considering the prices. I did find some really fab pieces. I couldn't show you, unfortunately. I didn't take them with me to the fitting room to try because the sizes were very, very small. So yeah, they had the odd size left, like 34, 36, most of the pieces I liked and I was actually looking for because there were certain pieces that I was eyeing and I was hoping they would be on sale. I found them and they were size 34. Um, so yeah, unfortunately, no ready to wear this time. I'm a bit sad about that. The shoes, however, so the shoe sale was public. It was open to the public in Selfridges and in Harrods. I'm not sure about the boutiques. I don't think it was... Um, public at the boutiques but yeah Harrods and Selfridges they had a public shoe sale and the selection actually was quite good I have so many boots at this point and I didn't really need to buy more um, that's the reason I didn't pick up anything nothing really stood out that I was missing let's say from my collection I needed so yeah I didn't buy any boots or shoes although I did like some of them um, but yeah the shoe sale was great at least the shoe sale was great so let me actually show you what I ended up getting I got two pieces so in here we have some jewelry also the jewelry selection was <laughs> very very bad they didn't have much they had some necklaces actually mostly chokers not even necklaces but most of it was chokers i was hoping to find earrings there wasn't a single pair of earrings guys on sale <laughs> uh, but i did find this which actually i have been eyeing since that collection launched so this is from 22k collection and i really loved these cuffs uh, when I watched the collection. However, I didn't buy them last year because they are very pricey. You guys know Chanel cuffs are a bit overpriced. <laughs> and so I was very pleasantly surprised when I saw this one it was on sale and the price was so good. It was I think just under 500 pounds. I did try another one and I was thinking about getting both. The other one was reduced to 900 pounds and that was with the discount. But I thought the design of this one was a bit more unique. It was a bit more intricate with the tweed and the CCs in the middle. Um, and I loved the pink tweed. I also saw this one, I think I showed you in the vlog, the same cuff uh, in, it was like a more neutral color. I'll insert a picture here. Uh, but the gold CCs didn't really stand out as much because of the color of the tweed so i thought this one looks better and it was my size so these come in different sizes so i was lucky with this one and i really like it i actually really love how they stacked different cuffs from this collection i will insert a picture on the models on the runway um so that's why i was thinking about getting both i was like i would probably never stack them so yeah, this is the only one I got, but I'm so, so happy with it. It's so nice. And then we have another box. I know many of you will probably think I got the heart, right? Because I actually wanted to get that before. Well, another spoiler alert, I didn't get the heart. <laughs> As much as I wanted it, I thought it is a bit of waste of money, although it was quite reduced. I think it was 1,300, the heart, and it was a nice accessory, but it was very short on me. The chain was way too short, especially on top of jackets and coats. So I was like, I would never wear it. So as much as I wanted it, I had to let it go. <laughs> Instead, I found this. You guys know how much I love these and I've been actually looking for a new one because I wear my Chanel scrunchie scarf scrunchie so so much and I couldn't believe when I saw this one on sale because this one I've seen before and I was actually eyeing this before the sale and I absolutely love the colors they only had two scrunchies left and this was one of them the other one I didn't really like the colors but when I saw this one I grabbed it immediately because the colors are so beautiful neutral there is a pop of red 
it and I love adding a touch of red to my outfits because I wear dark outfits all the time and I thought this colorway will be so easy to match with everything it will go with everything I also loved the tweed print print is different on both sides and actually what's good about this scrunch is that you can untie it's like a big twilly this one and you can wear it as a separate scarf if you want um, it is a long scarf i can also tie it in a bow similar to my other hair accessory that i have but yeah absolutely love the colors let me tell you the prices quickly so i have the receipt the bracelet was 486 pounds and the scrunchie is 201 pounds so yeah, these are my picks from the sale. Thank you so, so much for watching. Let me know if you scored anything from the Chanel sale. Send me pictures on Instagram, I would love to see. And yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.